hey y'all welcome back to my channel so y'all we got the right edge booster styling gel if you've seen the video before this you know what i'm talking about but it's a new day let's go First things first, if you are new here. First off, welcome. All my old time subbies, congregation, the rain gang, happy curl gang, welcome back y'all for another video. So y'all, you guys know the story. If you don't, I picked up the wrong edge booster gel. So I finally got the right one, okay, ain't malt. So we went ahead and realized that there's a spoon up and through, okay? Well, thank you so much. So I pulled off the tab. Obviously it's brand new, smelled it. It's, I, it's the sweet peach, y'all, okay? So yeah, I'm using the Carol's Daughter Cocoa Cream, which is like a moisturizing butter. Now, only reason I'm breaking this out, y'all, is because the consistency of the last gel, which is the fitting gel by Style Factor, that mess was so thick, and I was like, you know what? Let me just be on the safe side this go round. Um, so I chose to use a cocoa cream, which I love. It mixed well together. Um, but yeah, that was the reasoning, because y'all know I don't usually use no um, leave-ins while styling on camera. Um, and I just chose to do that this time around, because I didn't know what to expect. I already was stressed, okay? <laughs> so you can see how thick it is. And let me just get real honest with y'all for a hot second, okay? At this very moment, I hated it. Like, I hated it. I was like, so upset. <laughs> You'll be able to tell on my face, y'all, because I went through a lot to try to get these gels, or I should say gel, because I got the wrong gel prior. So this is the right gel, and I'm like, okay, like, what what am i doing wrong like is this the right gel so pretty much if you don't know the consistency is a lot like a jam it reminds me of like a shine jam <laughs> like borderline pomade almost like i just was not feeling it it was just not your typical gel it is very thick so be mindful of that it does have a lot of scents you can choose pineapple i think blueberry peach i chose sweet peach because you know i'm going to atlanta you know soon so you know i was just getting the spirit they moaned um but yeah y'all at this moment i'm like yeah this ain't for me but y'all listen to the commentary that's coming up um so you guys can further get how i felt about this gel don't skip and around yeah y'all <laughs> keep watching Alright y'all, so I don't know if you can tell with my facial expressions. It's really hard for me to, to hide how I feel in my face. So if you watched my previous video before this, then you already know that I thought that I was getting the actual styling gel, which is this, but I actually picked up the edge pomade, 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 whatever. Okay. Then I picked up the fitting gel, luckily, and just did the review on that. You can watch that review. I'll link it up above. If you're from the California area, um, I went to a beauty supply store in Inglewood. I'll leave it down below. To find this, I actually went to two of them because one of them I thought was gonna have it and they didn't. And I Googled it and luckily down the street they had it they had i believe the pineapple and the blueberry one i chose a sweet peach because you know i'm being atlanta soon and you know hot georgia you know what i'm saying blueberry didn't look appealing pineapple was like i don't know because i smelled the pineapple i had the pineapple pomade and i didn't really care for the artificial smell so sweet peach was left and that's what we went ahead and did so i'm gonna be real i hated the application Truth is, I'm tired. I kept looking at this thing like, did I get the right thing? But it is very, very thick. Like, it's not going anywhere. Like, this mess is not going nowhere. So, it is very thick. I don't like it as of right now. Yeah, let me take some. It doesn't feel like a gel, it feels like a jam. And it was very hard for me to get my curls to pop because my hair, it loosens as it's wet. So I need like help. This one, I was like, okay, this 
I don't know. I'm disappointed y'all because it's like I already did that video where I bought the wrong thing. So this is Edge Booster water-based pomade. Uh-oh. Truth is I'm tired. Options are few. Ah, but anyway, to go not down the street, like I'm not super far from Inglewood, but I'm not like extremely close from, to Inglewood. And then it was a whopping $16, well, $15.99, 16 bucks, um, and some change. And the smell ain't even all that sweet peachy, like, um. So I'm thinking like, you guys know I do not use leave-ins when I'm trying a gel. But from the last video with the fitting gel, I said, you know what, let me use a little something a little bit thicker. So I used the Carol's Daughter. I really wanted to use the Tropical Moringa by Main Choice because I love this leave-in conditioner. I have like the best combination, y'all, with this. I'll do another video on that. It didn't mix well in my hands, so I don't know. So this is how my hair is looking right now. It just feels like I put a whole lot of jam in my hair. Uh, and my curls are starting to bounce back, so I'm happy about that because I was like, what is going on? And I'll be back. We gonna pray. <laughs> Well, I'm going to break because y'all going to see me in the next clip. This is how my hair is looking so far. Um, it's still a little damp in certain areas. I don't know how I feel right now, y'all. All right, so y'all know I do not leave my hair like this. It's just not my preference. <laughs> ahead and lay these edges while I get my thoughts together. So this is what I got that was in the previous video. This is the Edge Booster Stronghold Water-Based Pomade. The pineapple scent smells like pineapple. And this stuff is the truth. I mentioned that in my last video. It will keep your edges laid all day, which y'all know, I don't be trusting no edge control. This edge control can be trusted and it is worth the money, which is $9.99, it is bomb. All right, so my hair looks really good. I cannot lie. This gel is pretty dope after it's been dried and all that. I didn't like the application at all. I was like, oh no, 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 no. Ew. But then again, you know, I did use a very thick type of cream underneath that. So I don't know if that had anything to do with it. <sighs> but I mean, my hair feels soft, but you can tell that there is a, a hold. I did stretch my hair. I did pick my hair out a little bit. So of course that plays a role, but my hair does feel really good. I don't really smell it in my hair a whole lot, but I do have shine. There is, you know, some movement. So here's the deal. I'm not dissing the gel. Are you sure? But it's $15.99. No, I feel like I would get the same results, if not better, with Wetline. Oh my God. This is coming right behind Wetline, but it ain't like. Truth is, I'm tired. Options are few. I don't know. Don't get me wrong, I think I have amazing results. My hair feels good. Like I already stated all of this stuff. It feels amazing. But this product didn't like wow me. You know what I mean? I used about that much. So not a whole lot. I probably honestly could have used way less, but y'all know I'm heavy handed. I think because I went through so much to get this gel, I'm just like, I expect it just to be like blown away. I got wet line that's two dollars and I got this that's 15 still like it yes I still like it but truth is I'm tired I need to try it again I need to try it again cuz yeah it's cool it's cool but it ain't like all that I tried the gel for you guys you guys really wanted me to try it um, I went and found the other gels so I spent you know $12, I bought two of these, that's $20, and then this was $16, so. Truth is I'm tired. 
Don't say I don't love y'all. Okay. <laughs> I don't like to watch other reviews um, when I'm getting ready to review a product, but I don't know what everyone else is saying about this gel, but I will say that I expected more. Still a good gel, still an excellent gel, but I just expected more. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful. I hope you guys laughed, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Thank y'all for watching.